guys, welcome back to my channel. My school science fair is coming up soon and for my science project, I decided to create edible water bottles. This is a step-by-step -step video of how you can make them at home too. For this project, you will need one gram of sodium alginate. Sodium alginate is used as a gelling agent in foods such as ice cream and jelly. You will also need five grams of calcium lactate. Calcium lactate is a substance to thicken and flavor food. You will also need a bowl with four cups of water, one cup of water, and a bowl with clear water for rinsing off the excess of the bottles. You will also need a slotted spoon, a deep spoon, a hand mixer, and you can add some flavoring if you'd like. You can also add food coloring. Today I'm using this flavoring, which is blueberry and raspberry flavor. For the first step, I'm going to add my sodium alginate and a squeeze of the flavoring. Now I'm going to mix it all up. got more of a thick texture and I'm going to put it aside for 15 minutes to let it rest so that there won't be any more air bubbles. Now I'm going to add the calcium lactate into the four cups of water and I'm going to stir it so the calcium lactate is well dissolved. Now I'm going to add in my sodium alginate mixture into the calcium lactate with the water. Now you have to mix it for three minutes. If you want the outside to be more thick, then you can mix it for more. Now I'm taking them out with a slotted spoon into the clear water. I tried experimenting to make some different shapes. So here is my edible bubble. By mixing sodium alginate and calcium lactate, you can make a whole bunch of different things. Strawberry caviar, glow-in-the-dark cocktails, or ketchup string. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'll see you next time.